Hello, Matthew Taman here from Learn Joomla Fast, where we teach you how to create professional websites without being a professional coder with Joomla. Today, I'm really excited to share with you an extension that is really making some noise in the Joomla community. You know, this thing just came out last month, and it's it you know it's a really great extension. It's from Tech Joomla, and it's an LMS system, learning management system. Now, there are several learning management system in Joomla. You have Guru and you have some other ones, but this one seems like it is, you know, it, it's very, very promising, and I'm so excited. And I just want to give you a demo of this. So it's called Shika. So here's the, the demo for the front end part of it. So you see right now, it's very clean, and, and I, you know, I just love how the layout is. And this is really great for those who have online courses and you want to be able to have different categories. You, you say you have all courses, you can be able to add as many categories as you need to. And you have you can click on each course to you know to get the layout. So let me click on this learn Joomla. So when you click on the course page, this is what it looks like. And the layout is very, very clean. Uh, and professional, you notice you have the image right there, you know, description, they can click to or more to see a little bit more. You know, they can click the heart that they love it or, you know, break their heart. So you have the course information at the very top here. And also you have who's who's this particular course taught by. And then you have the, the users that are enrolled in this course. And as you scroll down here, you can be able to launch uh, the introduction to video. You can watch, you can take quizzes. You can be able to set permissions for certain modules who do you want to have access to it? And this this looks really, really promising. And the, the developers, you know, they're partners, and I spoke with them about it, that, you know, people really, really are interested in this. So they've been working very, very hard on it. So great job, guys, on this. Um, so I so just scroll down here. It's very, very simple, and it's very, very clean. So I want to take you now to, let's go over here to the back end of it. Matter of fact, let's log in first so you can see what it looks like on the front end. When you log in on the front end, this is what it looks like. You have the enroll courses, dependent enrollment, image progress, um, and progress courses, completed courses, total time. And you scroll down, you get several other options here. Uh, recommended courses, my activity, you have the graph there. And... So the, the, the front end is very, also very clean. And that's one thing that, you know, really attracted me to it is that when, you, when you're building something like this, you don't want something that's very confusing for people that has so much, you know, so much going on. So they have uh, different things you can look here. And of course, as you sign up courses, you like courses, then it's going to show up on the back end. So let's go now to the back end of the site. This is the front end part of it. Let's go to the back end where all the changes and things like that are made. Now, I just want to say too that um, I'm I'm creating a course for this that's going to show you all the details from how to set up and use this wonderful extension. So let's go to components here and let's go over to the Shika. So now you're looking at the back end of it, the Joomla back end of it. So it gives you a, lit, a lot more detail. You know, as a site owner, you want to know your revenue, the number of students you have. You can you can have courses for free or for paid. And this, the, uh, the dashboard and the other categories right here, you have the course categories, the courses. You can create quizzes, uh, certificates. So if, you, if you're an educator or, a, a, you know, a college or entrepreneur, you want to create courses and you want for people to get certificates, and become certified when they take the courses, this allows you to do that, that once they complete the courses based on certain criteria uh, that you've set up, they are going to be able to get certificates and print it out. So this is the activity log here that you can see, and it's showing you the most active students. This is really, really great. All the students in your site, and you get a really good idea of who's really participating on the site, and it shows you right now to the most popular courses. So let's go over on this section. Let's go to courses. So on the courses section, the way that this works is you can click on new and you can be able to create a new course. And once you've added the new course, then you're going to get this, uh, this tabs here. This is where you can choose your, your training material. This is where you can be able to enroll the users and you can view your report. So let's go over here on the training material. And when you click on this course here, this is what you have. You know, this looks something similar to like what Udemy, another, you know, e-learning platform system. So you can be able to create a lesson. First of all, you can create different modules. These here are the overview. That's a module. The setup 
that's a module. You can create a lesson. So let's go with one of the lessons that's been created. So let me just show you, click on, let's, cl let's create a new lesson so you can see what that looks like. So when you click on create a lesson, it asks you for the name, ask you for the, the, the alias, the start date, the end date. You can choose the image for that particular lesson. You can choose the attempt and grade, uh, the number of attempts, uh, the prerequisites that's needed in order for you to take that uh, particular course. And then when you click on save and next, it's gonna take you to another tab here. This is the lesson format. But you have to put in, so I'm just gonna put in lesson. You have to put something there and then you go to save and next. Now on the save and next, it gives you several options for the type of lesson how you want uh, that you want to upload. So you have the scrum here. You can upload the scrum files. You have the HTML, the zip files. You have the uh, video audio. You can use the JW player. You can use Vimeo, KPoint, or YouTube. And then if you have a document that you want to upload, you can put that here as well. You have some text. And then you have some external tools that you want to use, put the source URL, consume, and things like that. So this is really, really awesome. I mean, you know, I've been so excited, you know, about this. And when it came out, you know, I, you know, I reached out to them um, and, and I'm like, yeah, listen, man, I definitely want to want to check this thing out. So, um, but when you're done, you click on, you know save and next or you can just cancel so this is what the back end looks like and you can also be able to create quizzes quizzes are really great because you want to test your students to see you know did they really learn something how much information you know how much do they know so once you're done there <clears throat> i'm just going to go over the questions um categories the questions bank so this right now is the back end i just wanted to give you you know an overview of what that looks like and you can click on activities reports it gives you detailed reports of you know what's happening so let's take a look at the reports real quick so when you're in the reports section now it gives you the user id it shows you uh the number of courses that each user is enrolled in the the pen enrollments that you have the course is complete so all the users that you have on your site is going to give you an, you know, an idea so that you know how they're doing and, and complete courses. And this is really great because, you know, being that I teach online, sometimes you have a bunch of courses and people taking it. But sometimes people start a course and never completed it sometimes, whatever reason. So this is going to be a great way for you to check up on your students and listen, you started this course. I noticed that you haven't completed it yet. You know, if there's anything that I can assist you with, you have any questions, you know, just get that conversation going. Uh, and, and, and you know, they can be able to let you know if they need help or, or things like that. And then, of course, the activity. And you can also integrate this with, you know, social media, uh, with, you know, like with uh, Easy, Easy Discuss Extension, I believe, with Jam Social as well. So I guess this becomes a community involvement and people can be able to learn. So this is a really, really awesome extension. And um, I spoke with the developers again. They're going to have a, another update soon that this is going to be a multi-vendor, meaning that this is going to allow teachers to create their own, own stuff like they, someone can register on the site. And they're going to be able to create courses on, this, you know, on the site, on the front end of the site. So the multi-vendor part of it and commission sharing. So they're going to, you're going to be able to share commission with your teacher. So you have a, a platform that people can be able to come in and learn. They're going to get the same opportunity to create their own courses and you can share commission with them. That's a new uh, feature that is going to be incorporated soon with it. And I cannot wait for that feature. So it's really, really great. It's very promising. And I know that they've put in a lot and a lot of work. So they have some other really cool extensions. So if you want to, you know, just go to uh, techjoomla.com to check out a bunch of other awesome extensions that they have. Um, and I know that you can, you're going to love it because it's going to help you, you know, with your, your Joomla site and to be able to integrate uh, some of the things that they have. So hopefully, you've, you know, you can be able to check it out and, um, you know, you know, purchase it, use, use it for yourself or for whatever it is that you want to use it for. It's a really definitely great extension. I definitely recommend it. Definitely two thumbs up. Absolutely. All right. So that's it for that, you know, little demo slash learning, whatever you want to call it. 
Uh, if you want to get more tutorials, you know, that shows you step by step how to create professional websites with Joomla without being a professional coder. You can go to learnjoomlafast.com where we have, you know, tons, hundreds of, of videos that you can learn at your own pace and always there to assist you uh, with whatever questions that you have. So until next time, see you later.